What's going on, guys? And welcome, welcome back to Void Train. Hopefully, you're having a good morning, afternoon, and evening. I just want to thank you all for the love and the support on the first part of uh, this little mini series or full series. I don't know where it's going to go yet, but you guys hitting that like button uh, and um, letting me know in the comments is if you're enjoying this, and we'll kind of keep it going. So, uh, I want to continue here um, because last time we started a little bit of a, a small little train and um, like our little little base. And one thing I have done since then is I have done a live stream of this, which was over on Twitch and stuff. And uh, I'm surprised no one mentioned it, but I don't know if I mentioned it in the last video. It's been a couple of days now since I played this. And I realized these actually aren't down, but technically they are down. I can still walk on them and stuff. Um, but I need to add some wood to these. I've got these little things flying around, which we were shooting last time to grab fat. Uh, and all that good stuff. We have our water container. We have our kitchen to make um, some food and all that good stuff. Uh, we have the workbench and we have a container. Our current objective right now is to currently research and build a container rack. So that's what we're going to go uh, and do. So we need to make sure uh, storage is and a container rack. So we don't have it researched right now. Um, so we're going to go into the research table. And we're going to need one iron bar, one wood and one bolt which we have our smelter over here um how many iron bars can we do we need fuel so how much fuel have we got we've got one fat let's throw that in there but like i said hopefully on a good morning afternoon or evening and welcome to another video on the channel um let's get some iron bars let's get them uh that's what i needed right i just need to get some more iron uh, and let's get some wood and some bolts. So if there, is there anything I can grab right now? There's some like wood over there. So let's change that and let's release the brake and back back up the train a little bit here. I don't think there's anything above us as well, is there? No, there's some wood over there. I don't know if that's going to be too far for us to get. But we also got the pistol last time as well. Um, oh, yeah, we can't grab that one. It's actually leather. There's some wood there, though. Uh, obviously, uh, we missed a lot in the first void. I was kind of getting used to the whole, like, the whole game and everything. Um, and it's the way the cookie crum crumbles, right? So, we're going to miss stuff. You guys will see stuff that I won't see stuff. Because when you're watching something compared to playing it, sometimes you're, uh, you get a little tunneled, right? And I, I know I do, for a fact. Uh, let's change this transmission. Let's head a bit forward now because I want to move forward can blow them up it'd be nice if they kind of like killed them you know when they kind of like blown up it is a weird place isn't it like a whole weird void and stuff we need to grab some more supplies we've got some uh chemical coming up i'll try and grab that the thing is as well is a lot of the stuff you don't really see because of the uh, the rocks and, and all that kind of good stuff. Jesus! Um, and some of it hide behind the rocks as well. So we're going to actually break here. Don't know how I missed that guy. And we're going to head up here. Let's grab some iron. We're going to need you. Some more iron. Some more wood pretty sure there was something else right there it is that's one thing it kind of drove me mad when we was uh, doing the first part of this is when we kind of fly over the the train like this and we are kind of high here we kind of automatically drop but if there's something directly above it it can be a bit infuriating trying to grab something um but saying this game is in early access uh, and it's still not finished. And a lot of you guys were saying in the comments as well, like, like they've changed so much since like you guys have played it as well. So, what's up here? Nothing. No. Can we move on? Let's move on. Let's um, let's get this completed. <laughs> so they're 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 now done. Because I noticed every time you put something down, even if you don't have the right materials for it. You will um, place the blueprint. 
so you can kind of play stuff where you want them and all that kind of good stuff. Oh my god. Swim, swim, swim. I'm going to try to just keep moving and grab what we can. And if it gets too overwhelming, we'll then uh, slow down. So we'll just kind of keep the train moving and bloody grooving. Okay, we're going to take a stop here now because I'm seeing a lot of items that we are missing. Especially when it comes to iron. Because we need a lot of iron. Oh, big old rock over here. Oh, we oh, weren't too far away. Let's just release the brakes. Three chemical there. One, two, three. You do have to, like, grab a lot of, lot of stuff. I'm going to... What I think what I'm going to have to do as well is put down a lot of storage. Oh, my God. We've gone, like, past a few little things. One thing I've noticed as well is, uh, you know, we're going to need... Whoa, 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 whoa. Why are we picking up speed? Wow. <gasps> Blocked by quest. Okay, I can't do anything right now. Enemies. Can you see it too? Yes, or I can. Hallucinating already. Look at all this stuff we're going past because I'm being dragged for Drunk forward. Enemies over there. Um, can they see us? Hey! <laughs> Hello? Draw attention. Well, whatever. We definitely drew attention. They're moving though. Okay, we can... Let's go back now, please. Because we went past so many items due to the train. I was like, why is the train speeding up? <laughs> oh, because of the quest. But that's a little introduction into some uh, bandits, I guess. So whilst this is going back, we're going to grab some more items. I'm just going to fill my inventory so we can kind of get multiple buildings done. That's going to get, like, completed straight away. Or used straight away, I should say. I'm going to grab everything on the left, going backwards, and then on the way forward again, I'm going to do everything on the right. Or most things. So when we reverse, we can't actually go further back than this barrier here. So this is kind of like, you know, you can't reverse too much. So if you go too forward, over time, this will creep up behind us. As we can see, we've now come to a full stop. So we kind of can't go too far back. So we're going to change that transmission that way. And grab as much. That, that seems way too high over there. There's no way we can grab that. But I'll tell you what. Let's just come to a quick halt real quick. Because we should be able to make what we needed to make right for the, uh, the container rack. So we've got plenty of wood. We just need to make some bolts. So let's smell a couple of iron boys here. Uh, we've got zero fuel left, so let's add, let's say, six six wood in there. We'll grab the iron bar. We'll then turn that into the bolts, uh, which I need to do the workbench, right? Make some bolts. And then bolts should then be able to allow us to research the... Not enough space. We don't have enough space in our inventory. Uh, let's just throw the chemicals in there right now. We've got some seeds as well, which I don't think we've got... A, a plot to place it down, do we? We don't. So let's get this researched. Once that's done, let's get it built. And I'm going to guess we could put two uh, two storages on this. So if we go into... Was it build mode? And we go into storages, container rack. We need one bolt, one iron. So we're going to put one iron... 
I'll tell you what would be nice is if we can build from storage. Um, I don't know if that's just an oversight or it's actually intentional, but it would be nice if we can, you know, pull from storage uh, whilst we're smelting or if we're like, you know, building. So I want to make some more bolts, but I also want to smelt under the iron bar, right? Smelt under the iron bar. Got my bolts. And once we've got that, we can put down this. So if I go into press N, I can actually grab this and move it, right? Yeah, I can relocate this. So I can put that there. I'm going to quickly pick up that. And if I go into build mode, I should then be able to place a rack down. I don't know if that's the best spot, saying because our handle's there, right? Yeah, let's put it on this side. Let's just remove this. Grab our hammer again. Move you to the... Wait, can I... If I was to relocate you to here, can I move this whole thing with you on it? We can. So, what we need to do now is build a second storage. It is telling us to move forward, I'm guessing because of this quest. Uh, but I want to build another storage chest here, if we can. Uh, we need one more iron bar. So let's get one of them smelted. And then... Let's get... Uh, another storage built. We can put that on top of there. Nice. So we can get like a few of these. So when we extend our carriage and stuff, we'll be able to put like multiple of these. Maybe like a storage carriage. Because uh, we can label them, right? Uh, yeah, we can label them here. And we can choose what we want with the icons and colors and stuff. So that's not so bad. Right now, they're all going to be kind of mixed until we can kind of get like, okay, iron, copper, then copper production and produce stuff. Uh, I'm just wondering if there's going to be... This is a container one, so I'm going to guess this container two, maybe. But let's release the brake and continue moving forward to this quest. Um and just grab some items on our way down as well. Um, I think we got majority of them. There is an iron piece right there, which we can grab. And then let's see what is up ahead. All right, so we're getting closer and closer to the gate now. We can kind of see this flame coming up here. But I've done a lot more grabbing. I filled up this with, like, iron and got this full with chemicals. Um, and we're getting closer to the end here, but we've not come across anything regarding just stating move forward. Um, so what I'm thinking about doing right now is making another storage rack before we move any further. Uh, because I don't want to go past all of these items, um, resources I should say. Um, that's... Let's add that. Um, that we might... Well, we are going to need. Um, because if we go into this next void area and we're going to be getting attacked and we need to move quickly we're going to go past so many so many stuff um so i do want to make sure we're kind of prepped and we're full of storage and we have some stuff in our inventory stock to kind of build what we need to when we need to right um so i want to get some uh iron boys smelted here uh we can actually go with 10 to be honest and that's going to cost 20 scrap which we've just consumed uh we've got a bit of wood on us right now we got some chemical in here. We don't know really what we can use with chemical. Um, but if we look inside of here into the uh, research table, there is a loot catcher's nest. Unlocks the building loot catchers. Doesn't give us a description of what it is. Um, but I also saw there was a science one as well. Yeah, lab. So I'm guessing we might have to use the chemicals for this. Uh, and then wait, and it unlocks the blueprint fat, I think it just said then, right? Um, unlocks a blueprint fat. So we'll be able to make fat, which I'm guessing we'll use something with a kitchen, maybe. So let's grab the iron boys. And for the storage rack, what do we need again um, to make it? We just need bolts. So let's grab some bolts. Oh, that's the research desk. Uh, some bolts in there. I love how the closer we get to the void entrance, the music kind of picks up as well. Uh, so let's do that. Let's build. And we'll just place another one of these at the side of this. 
like so. And then storage containers, one iron, one wood. So we can place two of these down as well. Um, and now that we've got that, I'm going to go into here and I'm going to rename this one chemical. We'll have this as like a little chemical storage. Um, and I guess we'll put that as U and we'll name it, we'll give it green. I kind of like that, it's cool. And then in here we'll make this um, our scrap. Oh. Change that to scrap. And then I guess we'll just go with iron, I guess. Um, Because that's wood, right? And we'll keep it like grey. And in here, we'll kind of make this our copper. Uh, we don't have much copper right now. But let's rename that one. Copper, we'll put that in as an ingot and we'll make that red. And then you, I guess we can just make to wood or miscellaneous, including the leather uh, and the seeds. And then uh, we'll name that right now uh, Misk. Um, and for Misk, I guess we can just kind of just put. Uh, uh, that i don't even know what that is it's just a block within a block well we'll use that misc um so now we've got that obviously we're full in here let's kind of readjust this around we still got the water water's full there we've not really had a use for water except putting it into the kitchen and making boiled water which then fills the bar up at the bottom which i think that's a health replenishment bar i thought it was stamina um, but it does consume, uh, it does go down faster when I'm like sprinting or if I'm like um, swimming or flying through the void faster. And I think it's what it is, is uh, it utilizes one of the bars you can see in the bottom left whenever I'm low on health. Uh, we could science it if I'm if I'm being totally honest with you, but I need to add fuel and I don't want to add fuel in there just yet. Uh, we've got some more iron here we can grab. So let's throw, that's currently scrap. Let's get 20 of you out and put you in there as well. And let's put another maximum iron boys in there. That's all the fuel gone as well. We are going to probably need more copper. So I'd rather build up on iron now and then work on copper afterwards. Uh, but we have a lot more stuff here I need to collect. So I'm going to get moving this train forward. And we're just going to grab what we need to before we enter the void. Um, obviously, right there, you, you saw me skip grabbing a lot of this these supplies. I feel like... Just for the purpose of the video and your, your experience, I don't think you guys like need to see me like just flying around here, grabbing this over and over and over again. I think in certain situations where like it's needed, yeah, we might do that. Uh, like for now, I'm just kind of explaining to you what I'm doing, but then we're also heading into the void, so I don't know if the quest might pop up anytime um, now as well. But I don't, oh, I'm going to listen a little bit too fast for some of these resources. I need to always shoot them because it's, it's got to a point where like I'm always grabbing the resources and I forget about them and I hear it stretch and open and it just blows up. And next thing you know, I'm flying backwards further than the train is allowing me to. And then I'm being pulled along. But I feel like we're doing okay for resources right now. Some of you who have played uh, obviously this before might be going, yeah, you, 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 you're saying that now. Um... But I feel like we're doing okay uh, for the knowledge we know uh, at our current state. So we we'll just keep grabbing more iron and metals. Metals are very important. So is wood, I've noticed. And obviously, like I said, we, we don't really know a thing for, for chemicals yet. So uh, I'm going to presume that map come into the lab. Because chemical lab just makes sense, right? It just makes sense. Right, well, let's get closer to this uh, void gate. These remind me like some tentacles here. But I'm super interested in what's going to be more with these, uh, these kind of like rebels on these trains, these little bandits, or what's going on? What's the story behind it? Because they didn't attack us. They must have seen us, but... Try and get as much as we can here. Because usually there's like a little barren part of the track where there's like no resources beyond that certain point. 
I noticed that within the first one. I'm saying it now. If we go into this void and we move into another compound, uh, like another... Uh... Yeah, you see how there's no resources now? If we move to like another compound in a minute, I feel like we're going to come across them. Uh, the enemies. All right. I don't think I can store anything else in here now, can I? Store all of you. Miscellaneous. No leather. A little bit of wood. Got a lot of chemicals. Right. Let's see what the next void is going to bring us. I like all the Nordic style of uh, design. Oh. There's a compound. B825. Expect a warm welcome. That's a shame. B825. Explore the depot. Um We've got all this on us right now. We're we'll going to grab as many supplies as we can. And see what's around here. We already have a pistol, which is infinite in ammo. Whoa. Hunter ammo, rifle ammo, shotgun ammo. Interesting. Hello? Friendly. Oh, did I just see somebody? I did. Uh oh. I did. I did say friendly. Armor. Whoa. Look at that reload animation. That's pretty cool. Come on, Bitsy. Sneaky little devil. Hmm. What's that sound? Is there someone else in here? Somebody else in here? Is there more of them? What is this? old radio box that always works repeating once again a self-made trolley small with armed motives unclear presumably linked to the personnel has been eliminated on post number and permission granted to open fire to kill over now he's talking about us i think they're talking about us there they think we're connected to someone huh we got here on a scientist trolley through his portal we're using his notes we're following his trail maybe that's who they're talking about a scientist Interesting. What is that? 
Is that an anvil? Do anything with this? It's like a place we can, like, forge something, you know? Okay, so the objective right now is telling us to leave the depot. So we've just got a little bit of lore about what is going on with the... A little bit of the scientists and who these guys are. Okay, it doesn't seem like there's anything here. There is another side of this, the the uh, the depot that we can we can head to, like over here, over there. I don't know what this is. What's this? The resources in this box will not be saved if you leave the depot without picking them up. Building box. Achievement, achievement, achievement. Nope. Another radio. Can't access that one. Whoa. Inventory full on the, the ammo. Not enough tokens. Piggy bang. Did we see that in the first episode or not? I don't think we did, did we? More ammo. Our inventory is just fully full now. Oh. Leather. Too chemical. So we can exchange like two chemical for like a leather piece in there and like some for the other items. Here we go. Wagon platforms two, mechanical engine crew two. So last time we extended uh, the back bit, didn't we? Did we? Yeah, we did. We extended the back bit, right? So we can like, it's the platform there. We have no form of constructions. Transmission handle. We don't have any form of rams on the back as well. Upgrade. That's going to need uh, a piston. Add wagon. Build module. And we can't extend the car. So we can't really do anything right now. Remember to keep putting your name suggestions of what you want the train to be called in the uh, comments. But I think we're pretty good to kind of go, I guess. Um, I'm going to... Add some fuel to this. Let's add the fat. And let's add uh, 10 wood as well. Let's get some copper bars going this time. Um, let's get 10 of you going. And we'll leave that to do its thing. I think we're pretty much full on what we can do here. We've got some iron boys in there. Let's kind of put that out and put that in there because I feel like that might be more useful, right? We've got you now. We've got just the miscellaneous. Some wood, some chemical. Some water. Ten wood in there. Leather as well. Right, we can't fit anymore unless I was to make another storage, some more storage chests. Hunger, hunger, hunger. Um, but yeah, I guess we can just kind of leave. I don't think there's anything more we can we can do there. And head into the next area. Oh. Not you again. I want to warn you about something. Aside from the nasty but harmless creatures, there are other, let's just say, hungry monsters. 
uh, pie. So, is that one of them? New quest journal. <sighs> Doesn't say anything about it. But apparently there's now more threats, which I'm guessing is that big old creature that we've just seen flying around. Because the one that I shot at the beginning, he's the one that latches onto your... Uh, your tracks, right? And you will, uh, on your wheels and, uh, lock them up. So, uh, our current quest is to build a loot catcher's nest. A loot catcher's nest. So we just need bolts, copper wire, and a gear. So let's go over here. Let's build, uh, copper wire. Uh, get ready for build a bolt. So, bolts and the gear and then we should be able to build a loot catcher's nest loot catcher's nest so if we go into here we can then research that I don't know what the hell this is loot catcher's nest not enough resources. One bolt, one gear, one copper. <laughs> what the? Hello? Hello? Friend? I'm friendly. Scared the bloody crap out of me. He started attacking my... What did others do? Oh, so whatever's blue is damaged. Okay. That scared the blinking crap out of me. Right, so to build it, I needed... Um... Back the hell up. This is reminding me more and more like Raft now. Because now like we've got a shark attacking our little our little uh, train. And to be honest, some of you might not like this. I'm not a big fan of Raft. There's something about Raft, I just don't know what it was, that I wasn't uh, a big fan of. Um, okay, loot catcher thing. Okay, so this is going to require water. Refill with water. <gasps> Hello? Hi! <laughs> Look at this guy. So what do you do? <laughs> Did you just sit there? Four seconds, three seconds. I want to know what what's going to happen. Hello? I just vomited and pick all up. Scrap my... <gasps> Did he grab stuff from... From outside the train. If so. Five seconds. I want to see if we can see him grab something. Just to verify. He did. Oh. oh, so we want to get like a little army of these guys. I'm not going to lie. They're adorable. Right? They are adorable. Back up. If he gets too close, just gonna bloody annoy the living crap out of me. 
Right, I want to throw some... Uh, let's get some more wood in this. I want to get some more materials um, kind of cooking. I think I might utilize all the wood, to be honest. Uh, wait, can I... I can't... No, I can't make fat, can I? We need the research lab for that. But let's make um, as much iron as we can. Because we've got all of this. That's going to consume. And that's going to give us 10 bars, right? Let's get max of that. Let's get them smelting. Keep an eye on that guy. He's going to sneak up on me now, isn't he? When I'm trying to grab some of this stuff. So, expect jump scares bits. You've been warmed. But I like how this guy's grabbing stuff. It kind of reminds me of, like, on Raft, when you put down the uh, the net catchers on the... Uh, on the And anything that, you know, passes through them collects it, right? That's what it kind of reminds me of. Um... Okay, I feel like we could uh, research and build a garden. That's the next step we need to do. So we need wood and bolts. And I've literally just used all my bolts. So we can't smell anything right now. But I can make some bolts for sure. We're starting to see a lot of bolts being made. So let's make them and we can grab some wood. There must be some uh, extra wood around here somewhere. There's some right there. I'm going to move the train a little bit forward. There's going to be times now where I'm flying to grab some of these items. And this guy's just going to pop up in front of me, isn't he? What did I just say? <laughs> Exactly like I just said. I'm wondering if we kill this uh, this shark, if he will uh, respawn, or that might be it for this void. I guess we'll science and find out. Well, let's grab more supplies. Grab more wood. So we can build a garden. Okay, so I got a little bit of wood. We should be able to research this. Oh, wait, I didn't pick the bolt. Did I pick the bolts up? Oh, I need two bolts. My bad. So let's quickly make some more. And uh, research that. Jesus! <sighs> Do you see why I kind of just added the face cam now? Because I had a feeling during this, especially now that I've got weapons, there's going to be some form of reaction. So, I guess you're welcome. Um, okay. No! Oh, he's so close to dying. I don't want to kill him whilst he's way over there, just because, like... I said that, like, and I... Oh, that was close. Um, just so I, in case we get resources from him. Um, okay, we kind of need more storage here. Um, but now we need to build the garden. We do have seeds. Uh, production. Uh, we need two more bolts. Surprise, surprise. Two more bolts. Keep an eye on this guy. I don't know if he's going to come from the same direction. 
Or if he respawns somewhere else. He's over there. Keep your distance, brother. If he gets close, I'm going to try and go for the kill. But I don't know if he's chasing them guys. Okay. So, Gordon plot. Gordon plot. We're going to need the seeds, I guess, right? Which I put in the miscellaneous. And then plant seeds, irrigate with water, fertilize with compost, which we don't have. We don't have any form of manure or anything, right? So unless... Are these? No, I thought that we might be able to use the vomit from these. Okay, he's off again. Right. Uh, research and build a lab. Copper wire and springs. So, copper wire and springs, uh, which I don't have enough room for, apparently. Oh, because there's that something. there. Make a spring. It's going to require copper wire and springs to be made, isn't it? I've not researched it yet. Hold. Hold, please. You. And then to make the lab, copper wire and spring. Yeah, so it seems like you just need double if you want to make it. Spring and a copper wire. And then we should be good to build this. So a lab. What can we do with this? Fat. Oh, okay. So to make fat, we need chemicals. And to burn, to make fat, which is fuel, it only costs five fuel. So if I was to put one piece of fat in here, let me just grab... Um, oh, I've got some fuel on me. Uh, let me just add some fuel. Let me add you if i was to make some fat and then i put one fat in here is one fat going to give me 10 fuel that's what i want to check now so if i add one fuel add fat it does okay so we want to use fat for fuel if possible we've also got unstable chemical unstable chemical which is another alternate recipe which uses chemical waste. And we've also got chemical waste for fat as well. Okay, good to know. So we use fat for fuel. I don't know, I don't know what else we might need it. Maybe for... Maybe oil? Lube? I don't know. So we have got a lot of chemical. So if I was to... Grab more chemical. Uh, add, we've already got in here. And to make that, it's going to do five. So that means I can technically do eight. So we're kind of doubling our fuel every time. And then we should be able to add 80 fuel. And then make 16 fat. So kind of leave that running. But I'm going to save... Oh, he's healed. He's fully healed, the little asshole. Okay, let me just get some things stored here. And then we're working towards the next one, right? Which is bandage technology. So bandage technology needs leather and unstable chemical. Okay, so to make unstable chemical, we need... It was uh, two chemical. So, we grab some chemical. And what else was it? Was it just uh, and leather, which I've got on me anyway? So, we just got to wait, what, 18 seconds for this to be done? The plants are going to take 105 seconds. 
Um, it'd probably be a lot quicker if I added fertilizer, which we don't have. And obviously, if this guy's not grabbing anything, we're not in the vicinity of anything, right? So I don't know what his uh, range is. Be gone. All I can hear is just the, the wings flapping away. Right, so let's make some unstable chemical. Let's store all the fat in there. You're going to cost us 10 fuel to make one. Then we can make bandages so we can heal ourselves as well. I'm guessing we make them in the uh, crafting bench. Bandage. Let's get them researched. Um, okay. Bandages. Bandage, here we go. Leather and unstable chemical, which I've got some leather in the miscellaneous. And I'm going to need some more of you, so make some more chemical. Which means we can then make a bandage. And then we can move on to the next quest. Because right now, craft a bandage at the workbench and pick it up. Oh, we need to make two. Okay, so he didn't die. Oh, I shot him. Oh, he, he blocked the bullet. I thought we actually killed him then. Um. Okay, so we need to make two bandages, which means I need two unstable chemicals. This is ready to harvest as well. We didn't get any more seeds, so... But we got organics, which is plus 5% for food. Okay. Let's make two bandages. It's going to take nine seconds. Okay, now he's died. That's way too far away for me to grab. Damn it, he dropped some fat, and I think that's leather. I don't know if he's fully dead now, but I guess we'll find out. So hopefully no more jump scares. But we have got bandages. Good, good, good. And now we can move on and start grabbing more supplies from this area. Uh, it's, it is telling me to use the bandages, so let's just kind of wrap myself up. New quest weapon. Cook and eat grilled organi uh, organics, which we have got. So if we cook and eat uh, grilled organics, we need some fuel, which I don't have on me. I thought I might have done. Let's make some more fat. Let's slow down here because there's some more supplies here we can grab. Let's grab you. Let's put the fuel into here with the, uh, the fats. Add some grilled organ uh, organics. So this, the, the, the raw version gives us 5%. This one, I would guess 10%. Yeah, 10% food. And we can munch that. And now, okay, we've got extra 10%. And now, it's telling us to build an army armory but i need to grab more supplies before we go anywhere so time to grab more supplies so we can build the armory <laughs> 